Hi everyone. All right, so this is a Tuesday morning haul. This is um, actually a haul from last weekend and today. Okay, so let's get started. Start with the paper. So I did post a lot of pictures on my Instagram of the different single packs that um, Tuesday morning got for Simple Stories. Now, out of all of the ones that I had posted pictures of from the Cozy Days collection, as you can see right here, trying to make sure it's focused, this is the only one that I got. There were probably maybe about six, I think, packs, six different packs, but I felt like I, this one was probably my favorite one. Um, I just like the overall colors of this collection. Plus, I'm always a sucker for the cut aparts, and I liked the back. These are acorns. And it's a pink background, kind of peachy pink in a way, um, really muted. But yeah, I just liked, I just really loved this background. Okay, so I did get that. And then today, um, I purchased this pack from Simple Stories, the Winter Farmhouse. Now, I do like these cutouts, but I actually purchased it more for this because I plan on cutting them out, okay? And these would be great embellishments. So both of these packs were $4.99 each, okay? For anybody that's curious. So I got those two. Um, I purchased this last weekend. It's the 49th Market uh, Seaside Shipwreck six by eight collection pack. So this was $5.99, okay? And this is what it comes with, okay? Here are the different papers, all right? So, um, I don't think I've opened this yet. Let's see, really quick. Oh, nice. That's reusable, oh, okay, I see. I thought it was like, all stuck together, but it's not. Okay, so these are individual papers, I guess, right? Yeah, so, oh wow, these are really thick. So, that's good that you can use that. And then, oh, here are the cut apart. Ooh, I don't want them to fall out. So those are the, the various cut aparts. Okay, let's leave that. And then here are the different, this is very thick cardstock. Wow, I'm impressed. I love mermaids, so that's the reason why I picked this one. They had some other um, packs, but I can't remember what the themes are. But I just like the more muted colors here. Wow, this is really, really nice quality. I hope they carry more from this company. They're all, is this repeating? I'm sorry, because I'm not really paying attention if it is. Um, but yeah, I'm, first of all, I'm glad it's not glossy. It's a matte finish, but it's, it's very thick. all back. Okay. Put that there. Um, I did pick up some sticker books because they're getting a bunch of them again. The last, um, the first time that they had started selling these sticker books at Tuesday morning, I kind of ignored them because I'm just, I wasn't really into it at the time, but now I'm like, yeah. So I've got Sticko. That's just a, it's a mermaid theme. Okay. $6.99. Um, I got this other st sticker book, um, American Crafts. This one has a lot of um, quotes and stuff. Uh, 
Now, the first time that these had came out, I did not get it, and I kind of wish I had, but now I got it. So this is the crepe paper, but it's really, you know, mostly um, Maggie Holmes. Okay. Um, I got this Happy Memory Keeping um, one, and that one was $5.99. Okay. And then the last one I got here was the food one, and that one's also $5.99. So I got a lot of these sticker books. Okay, let's see here. I also picked up this uh, printed tissue paper. Uh, I did see, um, great. I can think of her name, I can see it in my head, but I can't seem to <laughs> recall what, what it was. But um, I follow her here on Instagram and I'll post her name. Um, she had hauled these and, um, you know, it's good for decoupaging, um, like when you're doing, uh, junk journaling or actually mixed media pages. Okay. And then the last, well, actually, you know, it's not the last items. I also got these two, um, napkin packs. I thought this was really pretty and that was $2.29. And then I also got this one right here, which was also $2.29. Um, there's just 20 and you know, I mean, when you buy these napkin packs to use like to decoupage, I mean, that's a lot. So I'm wondering if there's a group out there that does, um, trading of napkins for decoupaging, cause that would be great to be able to get other ones, you know, that you can't find anywhere else. Cause the only place I can think of to really buy these types are like Tuesday morning. I know that Marshall's TJ Maxx, you know, they sell napkins, but it's never like these kind of designs. So, if anybody knows of a group that does trade them, please let me know, okay? So, oh, gosh, I thought I was done with the sticker books, but I'm not. So, here's some more that I had purchased. This one is the Paige Evans. I hope I haven't already bought this one, but um, I really like her stuff. So, I got that. That was $6.99. And then I picked up the Maggie Holmes one because I hadn't purchased this one back then, back before. And that was also $6.99. So let's see what else I got here. Um, I bought some face masks from um, this brand, Quiche. Um, I already have two packs from, I believe it's from not last, was it last month? Probably from September. And I didn't, um, I've not seen these these patterns before, so I went ahead and got them. I really like the quality of these face masks. They're um, they're soft, but they're thick, and um, it's all cotton for one. I think it's like a three ply, but yeah, my face doesn't really sweat in these, so that's why I went ahead and got got them because they'll go with a lot of the stuff that I wear, anyways. Um, I didn't mind paying three dollars, I mean ten dollars for three masks. And then the last, not the last thing, second to last thing that I got was this um, Jane Davenport um, bag set. Now they had them before at Tuesday morning, but the one time that I did see it, it didn't have a price tag, and the people at the cash register couldn't even like tell me how much, you know, it cost. Like they wouldn't even bother to look it up. So I had to put it back. So I'm so, I was so glad to see that my store finally got these. And this was $6.99, which is a really good deal. Now I hope that this stupid sticker will be able to come off because I plan on using this to store like my Traveler's Notebook or my new Hobonichi. And um, I can make use of these pouches for my journaling stuff. Okay, so not bad for $6.99 for such a big bag. And then the last thing that I got, finally, was this, because a certain someone here on YouTube that is a good friend of mine in real life um, told me that she wanted one after I had shown it um, here on my channel. So this is the Heidi Swap Make Pretty Stuff um, desktop display for $6.99. I was pleasantly surprised to see that my Tuesday morning got another one of these in. So I went ahead and snapped it up since I knew she wanted it. And you know, it's not a bad price, $6.99. So me and Clarissa always do um, box swaps. So 
her box was somewhat full and now I'm going to have to actually move it into a large flat rate because I know this will take up too much room um, in the medium flat rate, but that's okay. Okay, so, oh, I guess I could show this. Uh, one of the other things that I got was <laughs> this Hot Wheels set here for my nephew because I've been buying a couple of other things like this for him, but I know he will like this because the fact that he can try to flip it into this little thing here and that should keep him occupied for um, all of Christmas <laughs> once he gets it. All right, so that is my haul from Tuesday morning, okay? I hope every everybody is having a great week. All right, bye.